So at DCT here today, we're presenting some of our new products from our line. We've got the dual material Robox. We've also got a root and a tree. And the root and the tree work in combination to enable printers, 3D printers, our Robox, to be away from your PC. You can send things across the internet and the LAN to power and start your machines. So what we're trying to do with the root and the tree is enable lots of machines to be used in, in different types of environments. So for example, in an office, you might have four row boxes printing for the whole office. It doesn't have to be on one person's desk without one person in control. The whole, de the whole office can get access to the machines. And the same situation might be in libraries or schools, which we're having some success with selling now. Um, they might have a suite of machines in, in a tree structure, and the route is enabling the, everyone in the office there to use those machines from their console. Robox is selling really well into schools, into Scotland at the moment. In fact, there's quite a few councils, which is kind of their printer of choice. And it's filtering down now to, to other schools around Scotland, around the UK. Uh, and what they're doing is they're using machines in all different types of subject matter, not just technology like you expect a 3D printer to be using, but across the board in media, social, all sorts of aspects. Well, TCT this year seems a bit different to other years. We normally get a lot of communications between inter-industry people, to see, finding out what's going on in the industry today. But this year, it feels like we've got a lot of end users here. I think the, uh, the chat about 3D printing is got to the end user. People are coming here to look and buy machines now. They know a little bit about machines. It might not be their first machine. It might be their second or third machine. They know what they want, and they're coming here to get one. It's a fantastic time to be part of the industry. Technology is still growing all the time but there's still bits of the market where small companies like ours can attack and be very aggressive in.